Hey guys, good afternoon or morning. I've lost track. It is Tuesday and we are down at the White House. There's a protest going on in front of the White House I wanted to show you. Other than that though, there's not a lot going on in DC. Well, there is, but nothing I'm going to be filming. So it's going to be a pretty laid back day today. So the traffic bollard repair continues. These things get broken every few months it seems. They have to end up putting up a police car in front as a backup. Let's go down and see if we can find this protest. So while I don't have any photo assignments today, there is a lot going on in Washington. The Congress is back in session. Speaker McCarthy has just announced that he's going to seek impeachment hearings uh, against uh, Joe Biden, which is going to be interesting to say the least. And uh, what's up, man? Oh, it's a big protest out here. We got a lot of people out here. Let's go check this one out. So as mentioned, there is an impeachment inquiry about to start on Capitol Hill. The budget issue is still going on. We have three weeks before the Congress runs out of money, the government runs out of money. And we have a protest, I think, for Leonard Peltier up here at the uh, White House. Let's go check it out. Are they going to go over the fence? That would be interesting. They're up on the sidewalk against the fence, and that's where they usually start to give the warnings that they're not allowed to be there. Yeah. Secret Service white shirts have come out. Those are the uh, guys from inside, some of the officers and whatnot, and they're going to figure out how this goes. Leonard Peltier is the Native American activist who was convicted of uh, murder in a trial that's been sort of a cause celebre of a lot of activists and celebrities. He's got to be, what, 70-something? Almost 80? But uh, people are still out for him. Nobody seems to be... I think they're just sitting over there because it's hot. So I don't think they're going to give him some problems. Oh, there's some press bags. I was protecting people from being murdered. Over 60 murders never investigated. The FBI supplying the weapons and ammunition. Mass sterilizations. Our children kidnapped. Our language forbidden. Uranium mining on our reservations. Disrespecting the land. Forever poisoning the waters with cancers. This is not the seat of power in India. Look around you. All are relevant. So they're not really planning to get arrested, according to some of the organizers. And I don't think Secret Service is going to push it. Just let these people stay cool. They do have a couple teams out on the lawn, though. In case someone tries to go over the fence. FBI went out there. If we want to talk about the FBI family vendetta that has been waged against the American Indian movement and Leonard Peltier, we have to go back to one of the poorest places in this country. Why is it that Lakota people, why is it that indigenous people represent such a threat that they're willing to walk on their own constitution and keep an elder in prison? Oh, they've got a giant banner hung up now. We're on a bike now because, well, it was hot. I felt you get a little breeze going. I wonder what they're going to do with the banner. police car coming behind us.
Okay, so apparently they're planning to drag this up under the fence, but that's going to re get a response from police big time. So we'll see. <laughs> Police will come back and talk to them. I think as long as they stay off the fence, they're going to be in trouble. We'll see. Mr. Microphone's come out. Okay. I guess they're not waiting. Now Secret Service has taken up a position on the sidewalk. We'll see if we can call that action. Okay, let's get rid of the bike. It looks like we might get to a rest mode soon. Sorry. Sorry. Okay, so we're in arrest mode. Anyone in the street's gonna get arrested. Let's go dump the bike. Maybe we'll come back and see if there's any excitement. Do need a drink though. Okay, so there are no bike docks near the White House. We've gotta go down into GW's campus and find a bike rack. Uh, they gave the first negative warning, negative one. They give three warnings. That was the one that's saying the street is closed and then they'll start doing the one, two, three and then everybody gets arrested. Maybe we can get back there in time for that. Maybe they'll just dissipate. It is pretty hot. Okay guys, we are back. This is a much smaller group has decided that they're gonna stay out there and basically get arrested. They put up a tape line around them. We're gonna cover it from this side. Oh, here come the arrest vans down there. Secret Service bringing out their big transport vehicles. I don't know if they'll be given the choice of cake or death. But they might. Kick or death means if you guys walk away, you just get a ticket and you pay a fine. Death being you get to go to prison or something. I think they're gathering their personal effects before they get arrested. First arrest. Doctor! 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 Okay, we got the truck that does nothing out here ready to do something, but Park Police took the lead. Secret Service isn't going to make the arrest. They're just providing border security or whatever. Oh, we even got horses. I didn't see these guys. Bummer. The ambulance is for some fella who was hurting. We have some horses out here. Park Police Mounted Division. Five horses. I don't think they're going to be needed, but they're here on standby. It's the Park Police Mounted Division. Hey 
guys from FedEx Field out in Maryland. Actually, I'm not at FedEx Field. I'm just across the way at this little soccer field where my kids have a game. We've uh, left the arrest at the White House behind and we're gonna do a little dad duty for a bit. Okay guys, so I didn't get around much. As you saw, I had to run out to my kids' soccer game, but that was the protest at the White House today. Probably about two dozen people got arrested and uh, well, they probably all got released under their own recognizance. Anyway, I'll be back tomorrow showing you around Washington, D.C. The weather's gonna get nice in the next few days. We'll probably go up to Capitol Hill and see what's going on up there. All right, thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.